Hi everyone, this is your math guru. In this video, I'm going to be comparing the quadratic formula and the PQ formula to solve quadratic equations. Please don't forget to click on the like and subscribe button below for more easy to understand math concepts. The quadratic formula states that when you're solving for x, x equals minus b plus or minus square root of b squared minus 4ac all over 2a, while the PQ formula while solving the quadratic equation states that your x equals minus p over 2 plus or minus square root of p over 2 all squared minus q. This is in relation to the quadratic equation ax squared plus bx plus c equals to 0 and x squared plus bx plus q equals to 0. So I'm going to be using the same equation. On my left hand side, which is a quadratic formula, if I have a quadratic equation x squared plus 5x plus 6 equals to 0, using the quadratic formula, my a equals to 1, my b equals to 5, and my c equals to 6. Substituting back into the equation, I'm going to have x equals minus b, which is minus 5, plus or minus square root of b squared, which is 5 squared, minus 4 times a, 1 times c, which is 6, all over 2a, which is 2 times 1. This is equal to minus 5 plus or minus square root of 25 as 5 squared is 25, minus 4 times 1 times 6, 24, all over 2. Thus is equal to minus 5 plus or minus square root of 1, all over 2, which would be minus 5 plus or minus 1 over 2. So therefore, our x1 will be minus 5 plus 1 over 2, or x equals to minus 5 minus 1 over 2. This would be x equals minus 5 plus 1 minus 4 over 2, which would give us minus 2, or x equals minus 6 over 2, which would give us minus 3. For the answer, using the quadratic formula r minus 2 and minus 3. Let's go on to the PQ formula. I'm going to be using the same equation, which is x squared plus 5x plus 6 equals to 0. For this equation, uh, my p is going to be 5 and my q is going to be 6. Slotting it back into my PQ formula, I'm going to have x equals minus p over 2, which is minus 5 over 2 plus or minus square root of p over 2, which is 5 over 2 all squared, minus q, that's minus 6. This is going to give us minus 5 over 2 plus or minus square root of 5 over 2 squared, that's 25 over 4, minus 6. If I solve 25 minus 6, or 25 over 4 minus 6, I'm going to have minus 5 over 2 plus or minus square root of 25 minus 24 all over 4, which is the same as minus 5 over 2 plus or minus square root of 1 over 4, which is equal to minus 5 over 2 plus or minus square root of 1 over 2, that's 1 over 2. Therefore, our x equals minus 5 over 2 plus 1 over 2, or x equals minus 5 over 2 minus 1 over 2. This is equal to x equals minus, because they have the same denominator, minus 5 plus 1, that's minus 4 over 2, which will give us minus 2, or minus 5 over 2 minus 1 over 2, that will be x equals 
minus 6 over 2, therefore x equals minus 3. And this, using this formula, PQ formula, I'm going to get minus 2 also and minus 3. Thanks for watching. Bye.